So before I even get started with this video, if you have always been by my side, if you've always been a subscriber, a fan that has loved my content and always stuck with me through thick and thin, even some of the hardest times I've ever been on YouTube, if you've been there, can you guys leave a like on this video? It would really overrule everything. Your support is so much needed on this channel that you don't understand how much it actually helps. You guys mean the world to me. I do videos all the time on YouTube and I don't just do them to just do them. I do it because I love it. I do it because I have a passion for what I've been doing. I've been doing this for three to four years now. And I've been enjoying every second of it. I get to share my life with you. I get to share everything that I feel is right or wrong. And no one will stop me from doing that. I've always been the type of guy that likes to express himself in every way. And even if you guys don't know me or if you guys know me but in a bad perspective, at least hear me out. Because I would like to get to more people and let them understand how I feel and what's been happening. So... I've been doing videos lately on ISIS. Ever since the Paris attack, I've been updating you guys because you've been wanting that. You should always do what your fans want you to do. I've only did about four or five videos, and I know that's not too much. You know, that's not a lot. And a lot of you guys enjoyed it. Then some of you really didn't. You guys found it very offensive. And I'm here to say... I apologize if I did offend you in any way. Um, there's a few things I want to cover up in this video that are rumors, that are people just stating their opinion. And as much as I really don't care about what people think, opinions change other people's thoughts and opinions. So like I said, I've been doing those videos and... People have been saying that I do it for money. I do it for the cash. I do it for my income. And I could tell you right now that I did not make a shit ton of money from those videos. If you guys don't understand how YouTube really works, I'm going to sum it up here. You get about 100,000 views on a video. That video is going to make you about 90 to 100, maybe even 110 bucks. You get a video that does 40,000 views to 60,000. It's going to make you about 30 to 60 bucks. It, it ranges on on the amount of time people watch the video or how many minutes it's it's being placed on that video and how long you're watching it. Money is not the case here. I uploaded those type of videos because I wanted to get to an audience that didn't really watch the news, that didn't really pay attention. And I did. I did exactly that. It offended some people, and I am here to say, I am so sorry if I offended you. I, I apologize if I did offend you in any way. I'm here to make my amends. I'm here to straighten a few things up. So today I got notified by my network and uh, this is pretty big. A few people have already been flagged over having ISIS videos up. At this time, YouTube is censoring people talking about ISIS because they want that to die down. They want the whole situation to die down. There's so much videos going up on ISIS and uh, what has happened in Paris and more shit like in Germany, Washington, and YouTube is censoring those type of videos. Now, as much as I really see a problem with that, I understand completely where they're coming from. Would you want someone to talk about if your family member died? Like my dad passed away. Would I want someone to make a video talking about that? No, not at all. And that's why I'm here to kind of straighten a few things up. I want to let you guys know that the money I made from those videos is not going to me. It's actually not one dollar is going to me. 
I can care less about the chump change. And I call it chump change because it's 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 nothing to me. I do YouTube full time. I make money all the time. It's not it's not something that I'm thriving for. I was morally just thriving for people to understand what's going on. Kids. My fan base is from 15 years old to 9 years old. Even though I put inappropriate stuff on my channel, I like to make sure people know what's going on in this world and what's been happening. Everything I've raised from those videos is going straight to the Paris victims. Hashtag pray for Paris. For the people that are struggling right now, I'm just here to help. And some people don't think that, and that's fine. Like I said, it's over someone's opinion, over mine. So, if you have been influenced by someone else's opinion, I want to let you know my side of the story. I want you guys to understand where I'm coming from. I'm a nice guy. I'm actually a pretty decent human being. I don't think about money 24-7. I started YouTube not even for money. I started YouTube thinking how I can influence people, how I can have a huge fan base. It's like my dr dream came true, and I don't want people to change that aspect of me. I've lost friends. I've lost relatives. I've lost so much. And the last thing I want to lose is more friends, more of you guys. And I'm here to just tell you how much I really care about you guys. And if I did offend you, I apologize. But since YouTube is actually censoring a lot of these videos and they're flagging people down, I, I have a huge risk of losing my channel. I actually talked to a YouTube representative and they told me why all this shit is going down. And they just want it to end. They want it to, like, stop spreading. Leave it to CNN. Leave it to NBC. And honestly, I'm okay with it. I just thought I could get to a fan base um, that I could reach out to. Maybe that I could influence a little bit. I'm a little upset that YouTube decided to do this, especially without warning some people. Some people actually have strikes now because they weren't warned. That this could get striked down. This isn't strike material. But they're censoring. These videos. Now. And that that's happening. I'm here to warn you guys. So if you can share this video on social media. Get this out there. It would be awesome. Because more people need to know this. I would hate to see someone lose their channel. I don't care who you are. If I don't like you. If I think you're a, a scumbag. Or even if I think that you are a good guy it doesn't matter i just want you guys to be safe I, I want everyone to make sure they're safe and again money's not on my mind it's not it's not my main priority my main priority is to make sure you guys are happy make sure you guys have an easy life make sure that your days aren't as hard after watching one of my videos and of course you guys could leave whatever you want in the comments. You guys could leave hate. Love. It's not like I get a lot of hate. I actually love your opinions. They don't harm me. Hate doesn't ever demotivate me to keep on doing what I'm doing. Whether I get so much love. Or whether I get so much hate. I'm still on the sideline sitting there and watching everything go down. And I'm happy. Because I've gotten to the point where I'm happy in life. I'm genuinely happy on where I've made myself. And for the last time, this video, if I offended you, just know I am truly sorry. You guys are awesome to me. Every one of you. You can hate me, love me. You can even fuck me in the ass. In the end... I'll never turn my back on you because I still have faith in you like some of you still have faith in me. So keep that in mind. Keep that down deep. 
I love you guys. And just know I will never stop having faith in you.